Before watching the video, do listen to the messages of the original creators of this game, uh, Joachim Lundstrom. Put the microphone on. Okay, yay. It seems to be working. Hello, and thank you so much for playing part of Artifacts. Uh, it means so much to me that there's actually somebody out there that is able to experience what I've created. It's something very special. Um, so I just I just want to thank you. And if there's any viewers watching, like on YouTube, someone's uh, streams or whatever it is, I just want to say I I hope that the experience has been a, it's been a positive one. Um, because I I just need to try and like reach out to as many people as possible. That if you really like what you saw, um, it would mean the world to me if you could support me and my work by just simply buying one of the copies of Part of Artifacts or give it to a friend if you already own a copy. <laughs> uh, because <clears throat> uh, Frederick, could you um could you play some sad music over this? Gotcha, Chief. Okay, thanks. <clears throat> As a newborn at the age of twenty seven, I was always alone with plenty of friends around me. I was almost never sick. And I was disgustingly healthy. <laughs> so please Okay, you you know what, Fred, you, you you can cut it there, all right? Okay, thanks. Um, so yeah, thank you all so much for playing the game. If you hear this, it means that you've actually played through it. Uh, if you didn't like it, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm I'm just I'm just sorry. Um, I hope that you can forgive me and have a lovely day to you, the player, or potential viewers out there. Love you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. So this was the message from Joachim Lundstrom. Let's hear from Frederick Hatton. Oh, geez. Uh, hi. What do I even say? Um, I mean, you must be real tired of my voice at this point. Um, but yeah, uh, hello. Uh, thank you so much for uh, playing Part of Artifacts. I really hope that you enjoyed uh, the sounds and the music and my voice acting. Um, it's not often that you get put in charge of all three of those in a, in a game, but it's very fun when it happens. Um... Well, I guess this is when I'm supposed to be all emotional, isn't it? Um, Joachim, do you want to play some piano for me? Uh, I, I guess so. Um, I'll do my best. Okay, cool. So, yes, when it comes to uh, telling a story with, with music and, and sounds, it's all... It's... I... Um... Uh... Hey, hey you, you can stop that now if you want. Uh, you don't have to continue. Well, I can't play a damn piano. Uh, sorry? Okay, uh, yeah, <clears throat> anyway. I want to thank you for playing the game. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it. So, the way to support me directly would be to purchase my music off of my Bandcamp, uh, frederickhathen.bandcamp.com, because buying it there supports me directly in a way that streaming the music doesn't. So... If you really like the music, then I would really appreciate it if you could go and purchase the soundtrack. And uh, apart from that, I just want to thank you so much for playing. I hope you had a good time, and I wish you a fantastic rest of your day. So these were the messages from both of the creators. Now let's watch the video, the whole gameplay, the fast run, the speed run. Enjoy the game. Hello friends, Assalamu Alaikum. Welcome back to another video, another new uh, video game. The game name is uh, Partum Artifacts. This is Talha Kayyum about to start this game for you. I hope you like the previous videos of this, uh, of uh, the previous gaming videos onto my channel. And this would be another amazing one. So the thing is guys, I'm gonna do a fast run onto this game, a speed run. So without any further delays, let's start the game. Let's play the game from the beginning till the end. 
and let's find what horrors in this game i have played this game like two times before so that's why i know what to do in this game so just watch carefully just look at the speed run and we'll do the rest you know the graphics of this game are really really amazing and let's see what else this game provides let me show you what else this game provides okay here we are there is no cutscene but the, but this one the first one so let's start the game well the door will make a lot of noise a uh, long noise long shriek you can say that let's keep on going so the front door is locked uh, don't waste your time there it, it is locked so you just have to go through here and from here just go straight there while crouching get into this welcome okay i apologize in this room so uh, when you get the light from the basement uh, you will the see that there is a button uh, to open the door then you can open it right now evening's plans yeah. it is basically to set the scene but you cannot enter it without the light so just the wait for a while of the main art attraction is located in the sun room just to the left as you when he stops this speaking room. the door will unlock We'll get started as you get there. A again, welcome. It is an honor to have you here. Please enjoy your stay. Thank you. There you go. This is the sun room, and this, you'll have to collect it. paintings to well, install here. It's not complete, and that is the main reason why I invited you here. Now. From the beginning, just get upstairs and, uh, or not here, there. If you read this carefully, there are two types of armies, blue and red, and the red one is the winner. So the army is right here. So the password is 2718. And the password I'm saying is this one. 270. Oh. It's unlocked. From there, you don't have to do anything. Just grab this key. And if you want to read this, read this. You'll get a front door key and then let's go. From here, you will find this key. If you want to read this, read this. I don't care. Let's get out of here. And from there on, just open the front door. Don't go anywhere else unless you have all the equipments. So just keep on going. You'll find a crowbar also. Just uh, get that crowbar from the shed. You'll find a key to the shed. Don't worry, later on, just keep on moving towards the front door. Move in a sequence. The father of the house was undoubtedly the hardest there you go target okay me. these things you have to put them hardest here because i didn't know how i would react let him finish his speech <laughs> then you can operate how i reacted seeing him sleeping on the bed took me back to my childhood and one simple blow to his head was all i needed to leave him unconscious. Done? He woke no. Up, still in his bedroom, to the gracious touch of flames that burned beneath him. His beautiful screams were something I wish my own dad would have left me. But, alas. There you go, he's finished. So. 
the triangle that has a line in it, it, it will go towards this kid. There. And now, inventory, what are the key? I don't have any other key. So let's just keep on going. There you are. So take this kid, create it, this, take this man, oh, stand him, stand it here like this. Mother would be, wait a minute, the knife would be here. There you go. Disappointment. Calvin was a great kid. I almost gave up on my mission and my creations when I first saw Okay, now for that, I need a light. To this world falling apart. I could see myself in his eyes. That same fear. But, alas, it didn't take long for me to realize that he didn't have it in him. He was broken, but not broken enough. There was something missing. Was it hatred? Whatever it was, he didn't have it. I had to continue my work. Rest in peace now, child. He killed the child also. He's okay, now... Uh... Who's that? Okay. What I have to do is I have to go back to the front door. While photography isn't really an art form that I enjoy, there is still a fascinating area of photography history that I do give them credit for. Post mortem. Yeah, let him keep talking. He just want to say that he likes the photography of post-mortem, the dead people photography. I forgot this key. You have to get this key, the basement key, and then go back straight to the basement. There is the basement. And from there, this is the light. And you will find these. Uh, this would be the code. So remember this 9.
wait a minute. Nine, it, it's four. Yeah, nine. There is four. There is two and there is seven. Nine, four, two, seven. Just follow this path, these footsteps. And you will find this key here, the kitchen key. Yeah, this will scare you a little, don't worry about it. But it's just a mannequin. And here you will find the painting. The first one. Along with this. A map to look at. Now, let's go. Yeah. I knew it would happen. Anyways. So the first objective is we found the kitchen key. So let's unlock the kitchen. Here it is. And just put this. There. There you go. The next we have to go upstairs. We will find this here and this painting along with this key and if you see that this will, you will see this horror scene. Let's just go. You'll have to open this one also. Let me show. Uh, let me show you how to open that. There you go. Okay, now. Do this, move fast, keep on going upstairs back to the dark area. And do this. Too. You will find this uh, this small opening here. I remember being a child and having my own little hideaway in our crawl space. So these are uh, H E. Let me show you from the first one. His fat, disgusting body was too much for him to bother chasing me in there. And uh, this is H E. Anything was better than the constant beating and forced work. N would be here along with the painting. Just grab it. Nothing there you go. Ever be good so this is how you get the uh, first three paintings. Okay, so I was talking about these, uh, uh, you know, highlighted words. These highlighted words, in the end, claims that I mean says that kitchen. So you just have to remember this one. Okay, <clears throat> C5 is the queen, king B7, and H1 is the pawn. So you should uh, write it somewhere or whatever. So after remembering that, let's get out and move towards the room of Kelvin. His eyes reminded. Okay, okay, okay. To see if there is anything useful.
so let's go now we have all the paintings right uh, not all the paintings but we have three more paintings so total paintings are three I guess one two three yes <clears throat> so the sequence would be being reborn that would be the bouquet painting you know uh, this one this one's here a dance of agony it would go I didn't get it yet okay we'll get it later what's that he was the one here you have to put the eye painting <coughs> this one and this one would be finally free and here you have to put this one now let's go to uh, we have the crowbar I guess do we have it not yet okay about this password see the first one would be four five five seven password is <coughs> four five five seven and you'll find the shed key right let's go to the shed and we'll find a crowbar there the shed is right there there you go and there is nothing else so we found the crowbar and now where do we have to go is we have to go straight from the shed right here <coughs> into this cabin just open these if you want to look into here then you will find these two papers a reply and the renovation amount written onto a journal so just leave them there if you want to read them you can read them you will read this also here just go straight the up art of sculpturing this was absolutely the hardest kind so now you have to, to right. point all the faces of these statues toward this one and you'll piece. find this uh, you can say that what to uh, the clock timing then that dawned on you will find it here. The purest so let's start it. The human body. This took a bit of time to get right. Countless of kind, unwilling donators had to be used before I got the formula down. Rigor mortis sure was a tricky nut to crack, sometimes literally. But. After dozens of hours reading into biology and chemistry, here we are. And it is almost perfect. Please, just finish it for me. There you go. It's complete. You'll find this painting here. Grab it. <laughs> And the time is, uh, the small hand is in four and the long hand is in one, at one, sorry. Go back to the main cabin, where the whole story lies. Go 
get inside there and first thing you have to do is add the collection the dance of agony there you go now go upstairs oh not here <coughs> and just add the yeah it will do nothing i don't think so it will do anything there you go now let's go back Now, where do you have to go is, you have to go out of this cabin from this front door, all the way back. You have everything now, just keep going and there you have to play chess. Remember that code uh, we have uh, seen into that cabin? The king and queen type of thing and the pawn also no no there you go and the code is c5 b7 h uh h3 i guess yes And the code is the queen should be at c5, the king should be at b7, and the pawn should be at, the, at h1. Don't look back, there's, there's just that person there. I think it's a mannequin. Okay, now. Welcome to my little getaway. Why don't you have a seat and play a game of chess queen? with me? Did you know that Queen chess is, is a phenomenal C5. way of telling stories? A niche yet intriguing King would be at B7. Well, it doesn't really work and the like pawn is... chess. In fact, oh, all sorry. you need to do the... is place the pieces The Queen would be at B7 right and the pawn... There you go. The it's Queen, open. The mother of all the lands. What opens? The From King, here to right here. You'll find another hand of a clock. Now just visit there, this part, this part of the game, uh, this part of the room. Keep on going. And there you'll find another, uh, you know, code or something. So the king would be at a3, queen at f8, and g1 would be the pawn. a3, f8, g1. A3, F8, G1. Try to do that again. Oh. A3 would be the king. F8. And... There you go. That door is open, so you have to open these. There you go. Tada! Tada! Beautiful. The whole Carter family is here. There's nothing special here, so let's the just drum keep on going. Drum. I mean, go back, back to the main cabin, uh, because we'll find another uh, code for this chess game to open the red one also. Just use that uh, our hand onto the clock we just found.
the second clock is in the kitchen it would uh, it would basically be the first clock so in the inventory add this there you go so just turn this to <coughs> There you go. Now just go up. You just you have to now you have to open this. Okay. So you need a tool. It will be there. Uh, make it oh come on ten five okay uh fifty there you go 10.15 would be the good time. Here. Delivery in the main hall. There you'll get a screwdriver. Go back up. And there you go. I This is, uh, if I was wrong, the angel would stop me. He's saying that rest is the child. He just killed the child brutally. Now the door is open. The final painting. <coughs> Let's uh, put this final painting down there. Screams to remember. This is how it looks like, or maybe I'm wrong, go back up, uh, back to the Kelvin room. <coughs> there and you will see these Queen Helen is at 2 I don't know what to and this is G7 King George oh come on uh, passionate colors got it <coughs> and this would be the pawn it is on 1 Prince Eric 1 so I know the placing of king which is g7 don't know the placing of queen which is at 2 and the pawn which is at 1 so let's go back to that uh, <coughs> chess room
I'm gonna try this in an old fashioned way. So let me show you. So where's the king? This is the king. It is G7. The queen. The pawn is at 1 of what? I don't know. So first of all, let's start this from here. No. How about trying the initials of these? So uh, Eric would be at one and Helen would be at. There you go. So <clears throat> let's get into this room. There is another key. Tunnel gate. Okay, okay. <coughs> Let's get to that tunnel. That gate. The front one. Right in front of us. Call it the words of a dying mother. Body, find my mother. I was just unlucky. I don't want to be part of it. He's no People, okay, we'll do that. Where is Calvin? What did you do to him? Oh, I'm back to the house. <clears throat> okay. I'm turning into a mannequin too. Okay, so here you just have to change this painting. This one to the new one that I just received. I just got. It is done. Look at it. It is beautiful. And all thanks to you. Now we can finalize the work. As there's just one thing left to do. Please come see me in my little office downstairs. As thanks for all of your hard work, I want you to be the one that signs the work. <coughs> Don't be shy. Embrace this. You've earned it.
Okay, let's get down. Will, will anybody really care? Am I just wasting my time? Every area of this house is on fire. Sure, it won't happen. Nobody there has to go through the pain I went through to help. Of course, this is what needs to happen. They all need to know. This is the office, and here the game ends. Right. Uh, I will record a proper message later. This is just a temporary recording until after I've tested everything out myself. So, uh, yes. Uh, hello, me. Uh, remember to record a new ending before the unlucky one arrives tomorrow. Oh, and um, uh, d don't forget the cameras. Uh, this movie will be the greatest art piece there ever was. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> He's talking to himself and this one that I'm playing with the right now, the character, is him. The aggressive <laughs> relationships need to stop. People need to know when to speak up. This is why I'm doing this. Everything I do, every piece of art, is to spread the word. Let's teach the world and let us make sure they pay the price for letting me slip through the system. This is the end of the game, guys. I hope you like it. If you like it, give it a thumbs up and also do subscribe my channel. We'll meet again in the, uh, uh, in the next video of another new game. Till then, stay blessed everybody. Stay safe. Have a nice day. Take care. Bye-bye. Allah Hafiz. And this was the speed run. Do tell me if I do completed it uh, before time or, you know, short in a short period of time. Do tell me.